jumps a lot different than our normal step up jumps because it was built directly for our step up. The other jumps had like X Games in San Diego. The, they're kind of incorporated into the freestyle tracks. This jumps, the landing's at least five feet taller than a normal step up jump. The skill level to jump this jump right here, I mean, literally maybe a half dozen riders in the world could handle this jump right here, especially at that distance at 35 feet and above. Six riders in the world could clear that. Paul's idea was to make a metal version of this and kind of use it in a demo format. Um, that way we could just transport all the steel ramps and not have to use any dirt, which is actually a brand new idea. It's never been done before, so um, we're using this as a replica uh, to transfer it over like that. This is a new design that I came up with, some new dimensions, heights, and stuff like that. And it's to kind of set a standard for the X Games dirt jump, and also we're designing a portable ramp to ramp structure to do demos and stuff like that. So we've actually had a metal ramp fabricated and a metal landing fabricated. So we can just set it up in parking lots and you know in arenas and stuff like that. We don't have to worry about 15 hours of shoveling. Once we get the landing right, then everyone will want to do it. You know, because once we get the ramp and the ramp set, then we're just gonna start going as hard as we can. You know, because you know Okay, with this ramp, you can go 40 feet. Well, the next guy's going to, going to go 40 and a half feet, then 41 feet. And as long as the landing's good, then you can keep on sending it. We're going to base it off of uh, how Ricky wants it, and then we're going to base it off of that and make a metal version of the step up off of that and kind of make that our, our universal step up, so to speak, for, uh, for the demos and whatnot, steel version. I just think it'll be better, easier for the builders, just because It'll be the same so you know what you have, you know, and it'll be consistent. Then we can start, you basically know how high you can go and basically the sky's the limit. So it just makes it more efficient. I think Ricky could clear 40 feet, no problem, and I, I don't think anybody else could touch that.